Guys, it's a new day, it's a new day, it's a new day. Welcome back to part two of my real Ocherius Hotel vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed part one. And if you haven't seen part one, I'll leave the link down in the description so you can click it and catch up before you jump into part two. So, guys, I just woke up about to go get breakfast. So I'll take you guys with me. Also, just to let you well, you basically would have seen it in the first part. At the buffet, you are not allowed to serve yourself, so you have to tell the, the server what is it that you want and how much, and they will put it on your plate, and then you get the plate to bring to somewhere else. So, not like the usual style where you go and you just take up any amount where you want. So, I look crazy. Sorry, food. <laughs> but they're very nice. So if you want more, you can just tell them, say, you want more. And also like once you get up from a seat, they sanitize it before any guests can come and sit in it. So they are doing COVID protocols guys. So the view though, let me just show y'all the view. It's amazing. I really love this room. This is an oceanfront junior suite. It's really nice. It's really nice guys. Tell them Labs Outlaw sent you and see if you can get an upgrade. Is me? <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Oh, hungry. Welcome. Alu bag nuggets and alu no bag no one. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And I haven't even been eating that much. Don't mind that um, four plates. Four plates of food that you saw yesterday. I haven't been eating that so much. Right, Kelly? Breakfast out of ten. Five, I would give it a six. But I would say out of breakfast, lunch, and dinner, we both agree that our least favorite was dinner. There weren't many options, and 
the options that they had did it taste so good so i wouldn't say come to rio for the food i would say come to rio for the what do you call it the ambience the view the room the vibe the feeling everything else but the food all right but I mean, you don't die of starvation, so I'd still say come out and enjoy it. And who knows, probably when you come, you enjoy the food. You never know what's going on around the kitchen. Alright guys, so the sun is in my eye. So, we're going to go to the room and change and put on our bad suit. But that's the view. So they have a lot of pools though, like around five pools or more. That's really good. I hope I get to go in all of them today. So we'll see about that. Let's go pool hopping. Are you ready, Candace? She's not ready, guys. Oh my gosh. She's not ready, love squad. I keep calling you guys. Yeah, move, yeah, move. Yeah, man. Hot thing down. That's number four. What's popping with number six? Falling asleep? <laughs> Alright, see the six now. Uh uh, number one again. Yeah. Number four. Yeah. Number six, finally. <laughs> So they're my six and they're my takes. All right, ready? Uh, that's what, four? One, two bodies, right beside six and one. All right, one again. Uh-oh. Yeah.
Even after checking out, you can still enjoy the facilities and they actually have a courtesy room where you can come in and actually have a shower and change. So you don't have to worry about the checkout time being 11 because you can still stay up until lunch. Alright? So guys, we're back in Kingston. Well, I think this is St. Andrew. Yeah. yeah. So how was your weekend, Candace? <laughs> was great. Everything great except the food. Yeah, that's the big stick law, guys. The real food. But I mean, everything else? Everything else was good, guys. Everything else was amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The room, all right, let's rate it. The room, how much out of 10? Nine. Nine out of 10. Nine and a half. Nine and a half. Like, the only thing missing would be like, a tub for me it's so cool <laughs> <laughs> why, why, why you never get the full 10 i mean there's always room for improvement okay but it's yeah, really yeah. nice i mean they are very eco-friendly i mean your key card once you get in the room you put it in and that turn on the lights and when you're going out you don't have to worry about turning off the tv turn off the ac you take out your key card everything is off just like that guys so all right after the room how about the activities, like have fun stuff to do? How much would you give that out of 10? Um, well, the one I participated in it was... Oh, she did the water aerobics, guys. You guys yeah. saw that, <laughs> by the way. Um, yeah, that was really good. It was really good. Yeah, out of 10, a 10. Honestly, like... Yeah, give it a 10 out of 10. The work too, we could work now. Yeah, and they had other games too. They had other games too, guys. So yeah, but just that we didn't participate. Yeah. But they had stuff to do, and they had also they had um they had a water. Well, they have a water park. Oh. We never reach from there. <laughs> we never far. reach from there, guys. I mean, it's a it's a big property. I think we need more than a day, a full twenty four exactly. hours to cover True. everything. So there were places that we actually did go so i'm sorry 
I'm sorry we didn't get to give you guys a full tour, but I think we'll probably need a minimum of two days. Right? Yeah. To cover everything. Two days. Oh, exactly. Two nights, three days. Yeah. All the restaurants and that kind Yeah, of all the restaurants. We only ate at the buffet. Yeah, we didn't get to eat we didn't get to eat at any fancy five star restaurant or anything like that, but yes guys we had fun so the food now how much are you ready for? i already food at three out of ten yeah, guys two or three. i had lunch a while ago and all i ate for lunch was sweet potato pudding and juice like the variety the options weren't so good but we make it work we enjoy ourselves when we, we get our money's worth yeah, well yeah, yeah. i would say we get our money's worth food. But the drinks, them have nice drinks, really nice drinks. They have nice drinks. Drink options. Well, yes, and what I like about the drinks is that in the sports bar, they actually have a menu, so you yeah, know, non-alcoholic, yeah. alcoholic. Because yeah. sometimes some places you go, you don't know what to order. Exactly. Unless you're a rumhead, you know, say so a Bob Marley. Some places yeah. we don't know, so that was really nice. And yeah, this how you hold your the COVID protocols. Oh yeah, man, that would be a. a, a what are it? Yeah. yeah, they had good COVID protocols, guys. Yeah. So, thank you guys for coming along. In the next video, I will be comparing our stay at the Rio Hotel to my friend's stay at Moon Palace, Jamaica. So, stay tuned that you've heard our ratings. We'll compare them to hers. All right, bye. bye.